Have you ever been working on a project only to hit a wall because of an API limit? It's frustrating, right? If you've encountered the GitHub API rate limit exceeded message, you're in the right place. Today, we're going to explore how to increase the rate limit for your front-end applications. I totally get it. Running into API limits can feel like hitting a brick wall when you're in the zone. You're not alone in this. Many developers face this challenge when working with the GitHub API. Here's the specific situation we're addressing. A user recently asked, why am I getting the API rate limit exceeded message when using the GitHub API? They mentioned that after making several requests, they received a message indicating that the limit had been reached. Sound familiar? Let's dive into this together and find a solution. So what does this mean? The GitHub API has rate limits to prevent abuse and ensure fair usage. Unauthenticated requests have a lower limit, but authenticated requests can increase that limit significantly. Understanding this is key to solving your issue. And stick around. At the end of this video, I'll share a crucial tip that can help you manage your API requests more effectively. To address the GitHub API rate limit issue, the user should first consider authenticating their requests. This can be done by creating a personal access token on GitHub. Next, the user needs to include this token in their API requests. This will significantly increase the rate limit for their application. If the user is developing a front-end application, they should avoid exposing the personal access token directly in the client-side code. Instead, they can set up a simple back-end proxy. Finally, the user should implement caching strategies to minimize the number of requests made to the GitHub API. This can help stay within the rate limits. Fun fact, did you know that the first API was created in the 2000s? It's amazing how far we've come in tech, but hitting limits still feels like a blast from the past. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative approach shared by another user involves increasing the GitHub API rate limit from 60 to 5,000 requests. They suggest including the client secret in the authorization header, as they are using a private app and are not concerned about security. Additionally, they recommend setting the mode to cores in the request initialization to enable cores requests to the GitHub API. Here's the tip I promised. Always monitor your API usage and set up alerts. This way, you can proactively manage your requests and avoid hitting those pesky limits. And there you have it. By authenticating your requests and managing your usage, you can effectively increase your GitHub API rate limit. If you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button for more tips and don't miss our next video where we dive deeper into API management.